Kasim Afegwa. I'm here to celebrate with my brother, senior brother, a fellow Afa my man, in whom we are well pleased. We are proud of him. Very bold, courageous, he was meet. He's uh, celebrating two achievements. One, confirmation of the national honors on him. That's the second is what he's getting. Then, uh, today is his 65th birthday. Eh? We, I wish him all the best. Uh, he's a great you know, mind. He relates and associates with a lot of people. Uh, you can see the area of people that are here to celebrate with him. I can only wish him all the best in life. That's the best. And good health is very fundamental. He was in school right from Ife. Uh, first he started studying English, went to law, and today he's become a celebrated personality in the legal profession. And I believe that the sky is still his limit. He still has a lot of accomplishments ahead of him. I wish him a very happy birthday and the best wishes he can ever have for himself on a day like this. Can I explain how excited I am? Yes. It shows God's blessings in our life. Not just the birthday, C-O-N, and then the Kano's case that we won, as well as the pinnacle of it all, my son's uh, wedding coming up. So. What else can somebody ask for? I'm so, so, so great. So many celebrations all rolled into one. I am 65 years old today. Although I don't feel I'm up to 45. Ah. Celebration number one. Hallelujah. Celebration number two. On the 11th, just four days ago, Mr. President, Buhari, Muhammadu Buhari, President, Commander-in-Chief of the Armed Forces of the Federal Republic of Nigeria gave me the prestigious national honor of Commander of the Order of the Niger, C-O-N, to add to my already existing OFR, Officer of the Federal Republic, which was bestowed on me on the 29th of September, 2009, by President Dr. Goodluck Ibele Jonathan. So what can I ask of God? I, that village boy, that story of grass to grace, lifted up by Almighty God in his ways that are awesome and are ineffable. I thank him. I thank him and I thank him. So I'm feeling good, great, grand. Nigerians should expect more fire from me fire against injustice fire against impunity fire against misgovernance fire against breaches of human rights fundamental human rights and the rule of law i will leave no stone unturned and no turn on stone in carrying out this mission that it has pleased god to put on my slim shoulders God cannot do that which he knows will not be possible. It's Genesis 18, 15. It's Jeremiah 32, 27. Behold, I am the God of all flesh. Is there anything too hard for me to do? So if he can make me a story of uh, zero to hero, nothing to something, it means there's nothing that God cannot do. It's three lamentations. 37. Who is it that speaketh? And it cometh to pass if God has not commanded it. So I'm a story of God. I'm a living story of God. I'm God's own Psalm 105, verse 15. Touch not my anointed and do my prophets no harm. I glorify him in his full resplendence, in full adoration, in his full royal majesty. Now, yesterday, tomorrow, and forever, and ever, and ever. Amen. 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 <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Don't leave me, sir.